Am I pulling on this banner? Of course I am. Okay, so the game plan is to pull everything but green. I sort of have a complicated game plan because uh, I want to get uh, more harmonized heroes. But I'm going to focus on... Like, if I get a harmonized hero, I'm going to focus on them for the rest of the summon session. And so on colorless, there's Neutral Scythia. On red, there is Summer Edelgard. And on blue, uh, we have Winter Cordelia. And I'm not going on green, because I already have uh, Groom Roy, so... I wasn't planning on pulling on an extra banner, but I do have the orbs for it. Uh, because I, I, because I plan to, um... That's a lot of tickets. I plan to summon on four other banners in this period. Uh, and I'm going to subscribe to Fae Pass, not now, but uh, later on at the beginning of October. So, so just before this banner ends. And so uh, if I do get one of the harmonized heroes, I'll focus on them and I'll spark for them. If I don't, um, but if I get some other focus hero, uh, maybe I'll just uh, spark for another copy of them. I don't know. The thing is, I don't want to be left with an unmerged copy uh, of a harmonized hero because then I will be tempted to pull for a merge for them, but uh, I won't have the benefit of being able to spark uh, with Fae Pass for another uh, copy. And I'd rather just avoid that situation altogether. So yeah, um, I'm <laughs> gonna have like no orbs by the end of uh, October, so hopefully uh, there's something else that I'm interested in, aside from the banners that I already plan to pull on. Surely they won't release like a vanilla Kiza, right? Interesting, there's... It's not just a focus, uh summon pool, I guess. Uh, there's also a 5-star focus. Which makes sense, I see the uh, focus charge thing on there. <laughs> I think that's a, a pay pass benefit, but I don't think I would get to 3 charges uh, in 40 summons anyway. I mean, we're already at 11. And yes, I have a few harmonized heroes already, uh, but <laughs> ew. I am Thor and Loki. What is the meaning of this? What do you have us wearing? Ew. I'm gonna use her, of course, but ew. Yeah, it's a pretty good pull. Now I can be the one terrorizing people with Summer Thor. But uh, yeah, as I was saying, I have a few harmonized heroes already, but I only have like coverage for half the games. So like I have uh, that one copy of Bridal Tiki, I have Groomroy. As I mentioned, uh, I have a uh, Scion Leaf. I have all the ones that are both males. Um, I think I have one other one. <laughs> uh, Hatari Azura. Uh, so Winter Cordelia would be uh, sharing 
one game with uh, Hatari Azura. But uh, I don't have any Awakening Harmonized Heroes, so... Yeah, I'm I'm kind of like I'm not burnt out, but I've been spending way too much time on Fey lately. Uh because I've had to um revise my Ether Raids offense teams on light season because they really needed an improvement. Uh I had to make uh teams for AR Chaos season with the version 2 bonuses. I can do a full circle here. That took me a very long time, and yeah, I was using the version 2 bonuses. I know that the CYL uh, units are bonuses, but <laughs> I feel like the gimmick of the mode is to use those version bonuses, so I prefer to use them. And also, I have templates saved from the last time the version 2 bonus was a bonus. So I used that and just revised that, but it took a long time to do that, just because the meta just doesn't stop, and so I always have to reevaluate everything I'm using all the time. And same with summoner duels, because I had to make new teams and practice with those teams, and if something wasn't working well, I had to revise that. Just takes a very long time. But uh, we're past that now, so hopefully uh, this game won't be taking up so much of my time and energy. Yeah, with AR offense on Light Season, I uh, I believe I'm using Brave Sorin and New Year's Alphonse. And um, the idea behind that is that I can use Alphonse as a far saver and deal with teams that have uh, Kinchi Hinoka. Oh, no, no, not Kinchi Hinoka, a legendary Hinoka. Uh, because she destroys my uh, Bridal Tiki. I feel like Asker would be a better option, but uh, I'm using him on Astro Season already. And uh, I think I'm... who else am I using? I'm using Yuri paired with, I think, Brave Marianne. And I'm using Brave Marianne uh, as a counter for our savers which she doesn't do the greatest at, but the Requiem Dance is a very good skill. And like, if if she takes two rounds of combat to kill a Farsaver, that's like the equivalent of someone else taking one round of combat because you can uh, just refresh the Dancer and then the Dancer can refresh her again, so... I very much enjoyed the quiz that they released. <laughs> a quiz maker, actually. Uh, you can make your own quiz with the uh, Fire Emblem Heroes characters. Uh, like every single one released so far. And you have to guess their, uh, whose voice belongs to who. It's very fun. I've been doing other people's. And people like making funny ones, like <laughs> ones where the characters are literally saying their names. As for games I've been playing, it's mostly just been Fey, but I've also been uh, playing 
Uh, F099. That's been pretty fun. Although there's not much content there. I think there's only maybe like seven courses released so far. I also actually played uh, F0X afterwards. I had that when that was a new game. And um, yeah, I just wanted to play it again on the Switch uh, so that I could use my favorite character, Leon. And it's surprising how similar F099 is to F0X, because a lot of the mechanics are the are taken from F0X, like uh, the boost and the uh, spin attack. Yeah, I don't think I'm getting any of the Harmonized Heroes today, which, you know, it doesn't surprise me that much because um, I've had bad luck pulling on these characters before, so now oh, it's Azama. You're good luck. <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll pull all the... Oh, there's only two. But yeah, I think I'm going to be... Uh, getting a merge for Summer Thor. Because again, I don't want to be stuck with that uh, singular copy of a Harmonized Hero that I won't be able to spark for in the future. And again, I'm not going to be able to spark on it today because I'm going to be, uh, you know, subscribing to Fae Pass and the beginning of October, like October 3rd, so uh, not sparking today. Maybe I'll change my decision, but that doesn't seem very likely. It's plus res. I don't think she has any stat checks, so she has still water for her. Um, maybe uh, res isn't the worst for her. Uh, but yeah, uh, I think the next time I'm going to summon is probably on the upcoming Legendary Banner. Uh, so yes, thank you very much for watching. Uh, if you choose to summon on this banner, uh, you know, hopefully you get uh, more than I got, but um, I don't... I, I got a focus, so... And she's a very uh, busty... Uh, but <laughs> I meant busted uh, unit, so uh, yeah, I I will definitely be using her. So uh, thank you for watching, and I'll catch you next time. Bye bye.